so this might be the dumbest idea I've ever had, but here we go. Let's see what happens. Trampoline versus abandoned building. <gasps> no way. But my favorite thing about this mod is probably this right here. The Reaper Leviathan. So let's see how well this guy does against a plane engine, shall we? This right here might be one of the craziest teardown maps I have seen. So currently we are on a planet and I have a grappling hook, which is how I actually get around. So uh, it's a little bit disorientating as you can probably tell. But I have some insane mods to check out today. Stuff that I never thought would come to tear down. Also on this planet right here, if you could even call it a planet, beans should be around here somewhere. Let's see. Up. Oh. Um, doesn't quite know how to act on the planet. Oh, grapple, come back. Oh, blast onto another planet. All right, let's go. <laughs> this is so crazy. Sorry, beans, we're gonna have to leave you behind. We can also turn the gravity off, but then I'm just gonna fall out of the map, which is not good. Okay, wait, where am I now? What is going on? You know what? T take me over here. Take me to this place. Oh, it's so weird. Oh, oh no. Oh, I'm up. So this right here is like a gas station. So let's go inside, shall we? Let's check it out. There's no crazy amount to see. Can we go in the back? Eh. Yes, what's this? No idea. Just, just random stuff. Does this blow up if I touch it? Yes. <laughs> yes, it does. Ooh, look at this place. Let's check this out, shall we? Here we go. It's like a little jungle area or an island. It's got a track as well. And um, well, speaking of tracks, if you look over there, there's some crazy road with a car. Wait, hang on a minute. Before we go there, I've just realized, what is this? What is on this planet right here? Nice. We have a little seating area, um, TV or a fireplace. Very nice. But let's go to this area over here where the car is because it looks like it loops around. And it looks like it's going to be a lot of fun. All right, here we go. This is so weird. This is the craziest mod I think I've seen in a while. Right, let's see if we can actually complete the course, shall we? Ooh, if we fall off, uh, we're going to go down for a very, very long time. I mean, because there's just no doubt, if that makes sense. Oh, we've made it to another planet. Yes. Oh, oh no. no. Gravity, pull me back. We're back in. Oh, no, this is bad. Don't worry, I'll use my booster and we can return. Is it working? I actually think it is. Let's see if we can go to the other planet over here. Yes, I can't believe we're doing it. Beans, I'm on my way back. Hang in there. Right, let's hope this gravity pulls me in on the planet. Oh no, we've got to turn, we've got to turn. That's it, come on. No, oh, we've crashed. Where are we? Oh, it's so weird. I don't know what's going on anymore. Oh, we're on another planet. Oh, okay, well, we're safe. So that's good. Okay, take me back over here. And we're once again safe. But you know what I would love to try is blow up the planets. So I've turned custom gravity off. I'm now flying. And let's go ahead and blow this place up, shall we? Oh, sorry, buddy. Oh, wait, hang on a minute. Is it indestructible? Can we not destroy it? Oh, bay bomb. Oh, no. That was a bad idea. Oh, my goodness. That was insane. What if I turn the planet gold? Oh, yes, I've stopped it. I stopped the planet. Yes. Not destroyed it, though, which is what I was aiming for. What is the car doing? Interesting. Hang on a minute. Before I continue trying to destroy this place, what is this one right here? Is this a black hole? Yep, I can't see anything. <laughs> no, they actually have a black hole. Don't worry, I turned it gold. Where is it going? Oh, ooh, it's in the other planet's gravitational pull now. Again, these are not actually planets, are they? Really, they're, they're way too small. Oh, wait, it's been slingshot. Oh, it's going into the gas station. No. <laughs> Who would have thought me turning a black hole gold would do this much damage? To be fair, it could be a lot worse. There we go. Come on. Last prism. Do your thing. Maximum power. Yes. All right. Let's just try a nuke, shall we? Here we go. Ooh. I have destroyed all of the lights in there. So I guess that is the maximum amount of damage we could do to this place. So I say we get out of here. Let's go. So check out this new abandoned building map. And this right here is a pigeon, which I'm just going to go ahead and throw off. Don't worry, it can fly. It did not fly. Also, speaking of flying, another mod that I've installed. And this is a mod I never thought I'd see in Teardown, by the way. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to jump off the building right now. Um, you might think I'm going to hurt myself, but I'm not because right here is a trampoline. Oh, wait, now I might hurt myself. <gasps> okay, no, I'm fine. Good. That's right. Trampolines in Teardown. And they work very, very well. 
So uh, once I've played around with these trampolines, I'm actually going to go ahead and destroy this abandoned building using some of the vehicles over there. Okay, here we go. We've got some momentum. Whoa! Oh, we kind of missed it a little bit there. So let's try on an object such as this car. Here we go. Bouncy car. I kind of missed, but it still worked. Look at that. That is amazing. We could probably set up like some trick shots or something like that if we wanted to. Wait, I know. I really hope this works. Here we go. Oh, no, I've missed it. Oh, no. <laughs> Okay, uh, yeah, probably should have lined that up a little bit better. So there are actually different types of trampolines. This one is just a small one. You don't get much bounce. And I believe this one right here is a pro trampoline or maybe the no limit trampoline. Basically, I think you just bounce as high as you want. Okay, that is ridiculous. I've gone over the building now. Okay, get ready. And <laughs> oh, no. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to see how high I go. Let's see if there really is no limit. There's a limit! Ow! Ow! Now, you know how I said I wanted to use the vehicles here to destroy the abandoned building? Well, what if I just use a mini nuke on the trampoline? I really hope this will work. Okay. Here we go! It might blow up straight away. Oh, no, we're good. Oh, Ooh, okay. It kind of like blew up midair. But that's not too bad. We still did quite a bit of damage. Maybe we should give these a go anyway. Right, let's use the boost. And let's get destroying. Wait, I've just realized something. Is this building all on like stilts, like pillars? So if we destroy the pillars, can we take down the entire building? This is definitely not the best way to go about it either. Okay, yeah, you know what? Maybe we should use some uh, modded weapons. Oh, no. No, no, I'm fine. I'm not fine. All right, here we go. Let's use the lava gun, get rid of all the pillars, and see if the building just comes down altogether. <gasps> I got it. It actually worked. So now with my physics gun, I can just go ahead and actually lift up the entire thing. What? Okay, maybe we should lift this up and put a bunch of trampolines underneath it and see if we can make the entire building bounce. I know it sounds outrageous and it probably won't work, but we have to try. So this might be the dumbest idea I've ever had, but <laughs> here we go. Let's see what happens. Trampoline versus abandoned building. <gasps> no way. We just made an entire building bounce on trampolines. Are you kidding me? How is that even possible that is outrageous i need to get down here hang on let me check this out oh where's it going oh no it's bouncing into the water no <laughs> there it goes well that is one way to destroy a building yeah just you know what forget about it just put it in the water and let it destroy itself so with the building dealt with and the trampolines messed with there is another mod i've installed here which um is pretty creepy and i've not really checked out it's called blackout and uh, in the description here it says your flashlight doesn't work and you feel like you're being watched. Something isn't right. And then at the bottom as well, it also says there is more to this mod than it seems. What does that mean? Anyway, prepare to be scared. All right, here we go. Activate the mod. Okay, it's going to get very dark for a moment. Oh, okay. See that right there? I know this is terrifying and it's extremely dark, but my flashlight, it doesn't work. Anyway, we're being watched. There's a figure right in front of me. Let's get a little closer, shall we? Hello, sir. Are you friendly? Oh, it's getting darker. Hello? Hello? Oh, they're gone. Is there another one somewhere? We're going to look out for the figures. Oh, there. I see him. This is so scary. Hello? Please stop watching me. What do you want? Take this. Pipe bombs. Yes. Oh, now you can see it really clearly. Look at the silhouette. Wait, did it go? You know what? This is creeping me out. I'm out of here. Let's go. Ah, so yeah, that was absolutely terrifying. Anyway, back on the Boeing 737 map because I'm always here. Now, if you're a fan of Subnautica, then you might like this next mod because I've installed Subnautica Ragdolls. How awesome is this? So we've got a creeper... So we have a Gary fish right here. We've got a peeper. Um, yeah, we can go ahead and destroy them as well. We've also got a sea glide right here. Um, doesn't really do much. It's more of just a, you know, a prop in teardown. And we've also got a sea moth. Look at this thing. How cool is that? Oh, well, there it goes. But my favorite thing about this mod is probably this right here. The Reaper Leviathan. So let's see how well this guy does against a plane engine, shall we? Here we go! Oh, no, he's just crumpled. All right, we, we might need another Reaper. Oh, he's just breaking. He's breaking. Oh, here we go. Oh, we missed. <laughs> no. He got messed up by the engine. Oh, we've done a little bit of damage, though. Look. Look at the smoke coming out of it. Right, this is the one. Get into the plane engine. Oh, there we go. Look at that. Look at the fire coming out of the engine. Oh, it's completely destroyed. Of course, the Leviathan is absolutely massive, so it's going to do a lot of damage. Luckily, we have another engine here on this side to do more tests. Okay, so here we go. <laughs> 
There's already been so much damage. Oh, no. Right, into the plane engine you go. Ooh. Right, we need another one. That's it. Maybe we, we could just slowly put it into the engine. Yep. There we go. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Is that now both engines destroyed? Uh, yep, it pretty much is. All right, fella. I'm sorry, but you're also going in. Or not. Come on, just go straight into the engine. Yes. More damage. This one needs to be fully destroyed. I think he's still in there. There he is. Would the Seamoth fit? Let's find out. Ooh, that's probably going to do the most amount of damage because this thing is made out of metal and everything. So, yep. There we go. Let's just shove it in. Oh, no. Both engines are now down. All right, let's just see what happens if I put a trampoline inside a plane. Here we go. Is anything going to happen? Oh, no. Oh, boy. What have I done? Okay. Oh, no. Things are going crazy right now. I don't think that's to do with the trampoline, though. More me with a physics gun. Okay. We're going down. The plane is going to crash any second now. Wait, does the trampoline still work? Oh, it does. Okay, good. Still in working order. <laughs> oh, no. Ooh, what's happening? Oh, I can't see much. We got a reaper on the plane. I repeat, we have a reaper on the plane. Excuse me, coming through. Oh, there's a hole. Oh, no. No! Plane, come back. 